babies. Today we're at Harry's Charcoal Royal Restaurant in St. Thomas. They have a great special at them. We're nice and five. Special burger, so it's quarter pound burger, fries, ring, or rings in a bar. Nice of you, but not bad for a No, not at all. Okay, we did see the bagel expert leaving this place when he came into dinner. Mm hmm. He was uh, right there himself. Have to watch the bagel with him. You know, know who it was, right? Yeah. Okay, we'll tell you. It's Rod. Rod. Okay, so. What do we want to try first? Fries? Put a little salt on them? It's a small fry. Uh, I'll put up a picture while I'm putting salt and stuff on. But they definitely are a uh, fresh cut of fry. They are. I want to say this place really, really, really reminds me of Harvey's. How about you? Yep. I wouldn't be surprised if this was a former Harvey's. The burgers look a lot like a Harvey's burger. It's really a burger, but it does. Um, but the fries, right? Fries are fresh cut, like Harvey's used to be. Mm -hmm. So this is like a Harvey's, this is like a Harvey's plus. Better than a Harvey's. Fresh cut fries. All right, fries, they're good, right? Yep. They're delicious, they're fine. I love a fresh cut fry, everyone knows that. Okay, before, okay. See this? It is charbroiled, right? Um, before I take a bite, I want you to feel this bun. Oh, it is so soft. It's a little soft. Carly, the, the buns here are off the hook. And they are, right? Mm -hmm. We have bacon cheese, caramelized onions on this as well. Uh, pickles, mustard, ketchup, relish. mayonnaise. No relish. No relish. Burger. My relish doesn't want a burger. Okay. Put it on a hot dog. It's a rule. I just follow it. I don't make that. Very much a Harvey's burger. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Mm -hmm. They're not a fresh made burger. They're definitely a frozen burger. Yeah. Like Harvey's. But they're a flavorful burger. They are delicious. definitely flavorful. Um, I was fooled by Rodney. This was his favorite burger place in town. Well, up until we saw the Elgin backyard burgers. Now it's the second favorite. Way to go, Elgin. Sorry, Harry. We, we won't tell you, Frank. <laughs> you won't say his name again. I got to take another bite of this. It was pretty good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, that's not great. You expect that burger? Mm -hmm. Let's just, you know, I thought it was worth something, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, this is 6 96. Oh, because we put all the energy on it. Mm -hmm. Seven bucks when you put cheese and caramelized onions and bacon on it. It's in the trainer shape, travel oh shape. Oh my god, a thick shape. Now they're small, but it's not it's not expensive. That's a cheap shape, that's a couple bucks. Yeah. That's a cheap shape. Mm. That's a delicious thick shape though. Really good. Very thick. But this hot dog, this monster dog. Yes. They call this, you want to pick it up? For the camera? This way, it won't be me smelling it. <laughs> That's you. Now, they sell flip on hot dogs, but they also sell monster dogs. Well, this has got to be a flip on hot dog. Yeah, but I don't want to think the hot dog itself is Smaller? much bigger oh. than a foot long hot dog, which are $4.99 and these are six can change, right? Yes. Mustard, ketchup, onions, relish. That's a sub roll, isn't it? I believe it is. Um, this might be the most expensive thing on the menu. Yeah. Want me to try it first or do you want to try it first? Sure. The, the bun is super soft, just like the other one. Mm. It's really good. It's done on the charcoal oh, grill. Yeah. And the, the bun's a little toasted too, it's got a little mm -hmm. crispy. Now, this is a place that's stuck in the 70s, I think, okay? with the food and the atmosphere. But is that such a bad place to be stuck? Mm -mm. I don't think so. Could the burgers be 
a little better. Maybe if they're a fresh mate. Maybe. But I don't know if they need to change. No. I came in here thinking they should change your burger to fresh mate. And after having one of these, I think they're pretty good. Um, fresh mate may be a little better, but there's nothing wrong with that burger. That's right. Tell us if you've been to Harry's Charcoal Broiled. Tell us what you think of the burgers. If you've had this monster dog, uh, if not, you haven't been here, just comment anyways. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. Share. And look for us next time. I'm Dave. And I'm Lucinda. And this has been Dave Eats. Thanks for watching.